Hi everyone, welcome to this week's tutorial. So this week I had a couple people request me to show them how I do the camo nails. So I did two different styles, one with like light colors and one with dark. So I'm gonna start with the dark. So I have as my base two coats of Ride the Rails. And I'm gonna use blue. So I'm using none of your beeswax today for my kind of accent color in my camo. You don't have to use one. Um, in the picture that I posted, I used pink, um, but you can use whatever you want. So I'm starting with my detail brush from Uber Chic. And honestly, this te technique is really easy. All I'm gonna do is lay down kind of almost blobs of the color and then put little, like I, I call them arms, um, to give you like that kind of camo look. So they're like, yeah, blobs with arms. That's the best way I can describe it. So I'm just gonna lay that down and color everything in. And for most, like I tend to do like three, maybe four little blobs of each color. Uh, you don't wanna do too much cause it'll look like really overcrowded and stuff, but um, about three to four blobs of each color. And I am giving that a quick cure in between um, when I, whenever I switch colors. So it only needs about like a 10, 15 second cure just so that the colors don't uh, blend together at all. Okay, now that I have my blue down, I'm gonna go ahead and take my black and do the exact same thing. Uh, just going in the spaces where I don't already have any color and it's totally cool if some of your colors overlap with each other Okay, and then coming in with my GI Jane And doing the same thing and now with my last color I tend to kind of like almost fill in some of the spaces like I'll go like around the arms that are already there and sort of fill in like where you can see like it almost looks like a puzzle when you're doing it and then same thing giving that a good cure and then see the exact same thing if you're doing it with light colors i'm just going to quickly fast forward through these so you can just see me lay them down but it's the exact same technique making sure you're um curing in between uh, but for a light i like to start with a base color of relay gray And my accent color in my light nails today is Show Me the Honey. And then I'm just using white. And instead of the G.I. Jane, I'm using the Ride the Rails for my dark color. And then you're gonna go ahead and finish that nail off like you normally would with your building gel and all your finish filing and a top coat. Today I used the Super Shiny from Light Elegance, but you can use whatever top coat you like. And as always, finishing off with some cuticle oil. Today I'm using the Light Elegance cuticle oil, all natural, jojoba, basil, lavender, and tea tree oils. Give that a quick little rub. And there you have it, the camo nails. Super easy technique. It's really abstract, so there is no real wrong way of doing it. My best advice is just remember to pull those little kind of arms off of your blobs, and that'll give you more of a camo type look to it. And as always, questions and comments in the section below. If you have any suggestions for videos, give me an email. It's tessa at nailbasics.ca. And I also just wanted to quickly say thank you so much to everybody that came in for Open House. We had an awesome weekend. It was really nice to see everyone. And thank you again for all of your support over the years.